Here's my studio in the daytime. For most of the day, it's shielded from the light, which is lovely. And then in the afternoon, it gets quite hot and I can put the blinds down. I don't need much space. I quite like working on one painting at a time or perhaps two. And it seems to me that there's much closer link between the paintings and the prints now. So I kind of do the same sort of thing in both the painting and the print at the same time and divide my time between painting four days a week and printing three days a week. But you can see that the studio is tiny. The books are important. And um, I also, some of the time, uh, work on the computer when I'm stuck on a painting, but I try not to do that too much. Um, I try and do that in another place, in a shepherd's hut, where I sleep at night when I can. Lots of drawing books. They're also kept in another place that I use as a sort of basis for things. And I think that's about it. My palette could be better organised. I always used to tell my students to organise their palette better and then I find myself not doing it very well either. But I mix colours in old pots a lot. I like this space a lot. I could have built a bigger place, but I don't really need it. And then there's music, lots of music. And plays and audiobooks.